I don't know if you've come in contact with these reality shifters who believe they can like shift themselves to another reality. It was like a big TikTok trend. I don't know if it's still a trend now, but it's like a thing where thousands of these kids, mostly teenagers, believe they can shift to another reality, right? And since I own a lucid dreaming discord with like a few thousand people, I like I've always come across these reality shifters <laughs> who come in the discord from time to time uh, Even though they claim it's not related to lucid dreaming and it's not a lucid dream for some reason You'll just sometimes get these people joining lucid dreaming discords for some reason because some of them Shifting methods like are related to lucid dreaming or something. I don't know But these guys are always like fucking insane. I swear I mean not to judge anyone one not to judge anyone but if you ever come across these reality shifters and like kind of try and debate with them I guess or argue with them about why it's not real they become really defensive and they can never explain why reality shifting is like not a dream right <laughs> and then and the, these guys these reality shifters are always kind of weird like they always just want to go they always want to go to Hogwarts for some reason these reality shifters they all want to shift to Hogwarts and like fuck Draco Malfoy or something, which I don't blame them. I mean, it's Draco Malfoy. Come on. No, no homo. But like, <laughs> but yeah, it's just they all want to go to Hogwarts for some reason. And so these people are all fucking annoying. And so I've always just been like, you know, reality shifting is just bullshit. It's just a dream. It's just, it's just lucid dreaming or they're incubating a dream or something. But recently, Recently, you know, since I'm such an open-minded person, <laughs> I just decided, you know what, I don't know much about reality shifting, so maybe I'll just do some research into it. It's probably bullshit, but I'll research it anyways, because I'm such an open-minded person. <laughs> so I was thinking, there's probably a lot of reality shifting information out there, so I didn't know what the best place to go was. And so then I just got thinking, what's the best place to go for information what would be the best place to go to find out about reality shifting of course i thought reddit <laughs> of course reddit the best source of legit information ever and like where where else am i meant to go i would rather trust reddit than some fucking tiktok anyway so i went on the reality shifting reddit there's actually like over a hundred thousand people in this as well so i went on this reality shifting reddit and I went on their wiki because I don't know shit. I really don't know shit about reality shifting, right? So I went on like their frequently asked questions thing and I started like scrolling through all this boring shit, blah, blah, blah. We're all going to Hogwarts, blah, blah. And, so, and then I came across, I came across this section where they started talking about why reality shifting was not a dream and why it wasn't a lucid dream. And since I had hundreds of lucid dreams and I was always into lucid dreaming. I was like, okay, that's interesting. I'll read this shit then. <laughs> so they started trying to explain why reality, reality shifting was not a dream or a lucid dream. And this was the first like major red flag I saw for this whole reality shifting shit is because their reasoning, their reasoning for reality shifting not being a dream is just like crap, bro. They said, they said reality shifting is not a dream because dreams are like hazy. They're unrealistic, they change, they're inconsistent, you know, like typical ideas of dreams, they change, they're blurry, blah, blah, blah. And they also said that it's not a lucid dream because in a lucid dream, you can change anything you want, like anytime you want, you can change anything, you have full control. And so this was when I was like, okay, this, this shit's just crap, bro. <laughs> like these guys clearly have no idea what a, like vivid dream is <laughs> or a vivid lucid dream is because it's true that you can control a lucid dream, right? If you want, you can control a lucid dream, except if you genuinely believe it's not a dream because your dreams work around your expectations. If you genuinely believe this dream you're in is actually not a dream and believe it's say another reality, <laughs> believe it's another reality genuinely, that dream is going to be as vivid as real life, if not more real than real life, which I've experienced before. You can have lucid dreams more real than real life and you can have lucid dreams where you have no control as well. If you're in a, if you're in a dream, a, a dream, <laughs> if you're actually in a dream or a lucid dream, 
and you genuinely believe it's not a dream and it's another reality, you're going to have no control and your reality checks may actually fail. That's another thing they brought up. They were saying reality shifting is not a dream because your reality checks won't work or some shit. There's been times in, there's literally been times in a lucid dream though where I've done like three reality checks in a row and none of them fucking work. So I just keep thinking that I'm awake even though I'm in a dream. So... They clearly don't know really anything about lucid dreams or dreams and their reasoning for that's crap. But you know what? I was like, that's cool. That's cool. I'm still going to keep an open mind, right? Why don't I just go to their techniques and do some techniques and see if I can shift to another reality? That's what I was thinking. I'll find out their techniques. I'll try their techniques. I'll shift to Hogwarts. I'll fucking, I don't know, go to Draco Malfoy or some shit. I'll just, I'll shift to Hogwarts and go hang out with Draco Malfoy and do all this shit. Um, so I scrolled, I had to scroll through all this other boring crap talking about all these shifting terms and blah, blah, blah. And so I found their technique section finally. And when I start, and I was really excited for this actually, because I was like, okay, this is good. I'm going to be able to shift. I'm going to be able to see if this is legit, right? When I saw their list of fucking shifting methods, I knew that's when I knew reality, reality shifting was just complete and utter bullshit, bro. <laughs> because I'm telling you now, every single one of their techniques was a dream incubation technique, bro. <laughs> Literally every single one of their techniques was a technique for incubating a dream. And what I mean by that is basically just choosing what to dream about. Every single one of these fucking shifting methods was just a dream incubation method, bro. And I know this because for the past week, I've been trying to incubate a dream and I've done a shit ton of research on choosing what to dream about and having a dream that you want. So I was thinking, how the hell am I meant to shift if all your shifting methods are just dream incubation methods, bruv. How does that even make sense? Literally all, all your fucking shifting methods are literally just dream incubation methods or lucid dreaming methods. And I'm not making that up because 90% of these methods they listed were like, do like, it was like visualize before bed, say affirmations before bed, say you're in Hogwarts before you go to sleep, then go to sleep and you'll wake up in your desired reality, right? Yeah, wake up. <laughs> as, if, as if you're not just going to sleep and fucking having a really vivid dream that you're in Hogwarts and fucking Draco Malfoy. So that's, that's literally all it is, is dream incubation. And honestly, I kind of assumed that when I first heard about reality shifting, but I wasn't sure. I was like, you know, it's probably dream incubation, but I wasn't sure. That's why I started reading their wiki. I read all this information, bro. Then I saw their methods. I was like, okay, I was right. It's just retarded. <laughs> it's been retarded this whole time. So I wasted all that fucking time. I was actually going to try the shifting methods. I'm not making that up. I like, I know this whole video sounds like I'm judging like reality shifters, which I am, but <laughs> I was gonna, I was actually going to try their methods, but I can't because I just dream incubation methods, bro. <laughs> it's just going to give me a dream that I want. Maybe it'll give me a dream that I want and it'll be really vivid because maybe I can trick my mind into thinking I'm in another reality. But at the end of the day, it's just dream incubation, bro. So reality shifting is kind of retarded. Um... But you know, I mean, I know this whole video has just been me judging them, but I think it's really sad that, I think it's sad that people must hate their lives so much or have some bad shit going in their, going in, in their lives, go, going on in their lives. <laughs> they, they must have some bad shit going on in their lives that they convince themselves they can shift themselves to another reality just to escape it. I think that's pretty, I think that's pretty bad. I kind of feel bad for them.